Hey everybody, today I'm going to give you a quick little video on how you can actually put together all your rides on the one map. I see time and time again in Facebook groups people asking how they can take their Google timeline and export it to make one solid map of the route. So I'm going to give you a quick walkthrough of what I do and how I do it to get the results that I get. Go to your Google Maps and select Timeline. Once your timeline is open, go through each of the days of your trip click on the specific day and go to the icon in the bottom right hand corner that looks like a gear. Select the option to export that day to KML. Follow the step for each of the days that you wish to bring down and merge into one map. Now that you have a KML file for each day, go to KMLmerger.com, select your files that you've just downloaded for each day and click Merge Away. This will download one file with all your routes in it. Now point your browser at google.com slash mymaps and create a new map. Since we now have the one merged KML file, drag and drop it onto the browse button to upload that file and load it into your map. The KML file has a lot of data in it. There are pin locations for each location you've stopped as well as the paths between them all. One thing I start off by doing first is creating a new map layer for all the hotel stays that I stayed at. Now this doesn't need to be just hotels. This could be anywhere you want to pin on the map for a point of interest. You can put into a separate layer or put it into one layer with all the hotel stays. There may be multiple pins for any point of interest on the map. You only need to save one and move it to the new layer. This process can be a little tedious to do, but you'll see why for the next couple of steps. Once you have your pins sorted, you can begin going through and deleting the remaining ones on the main map. These pins are for any location that you spend a couple of minutes in instead of just traveling through. Now that we have all the extra pins out of the main layer, scroll up to the top and select individual styles with the paint roller icon and change that to be uniform style. Complete the same process for any additional layers that you've sorted pins into. Now that everything in the layer is grouped in all items, you can click the paint bucket beside it and select a color as well as set the line width for the route. For your layers for your pins, select the paint bucket and you can change the color as well as the icon from the selected list below. Clicking more icons will give you a larger list of selectable icons you can use. And that's it. Now you've got your entire route mapped out with your points of interest all on one single map. I do this once a year for all the rides that I do every summer and I take that and print it out to a nice big poster size. I hope this was a helpful example on how to convert your Google timeline into a mapped route. If it was, please like the video to help others find this.